was a big bleh. did it again screwed up right from the get-go was England bade our wild geese fly to that small nations might be free but their lonely graves I bar silvers waves or the fringe of the great North Sea Oh had they died by Pierce's side or fought with Cathal Brew their names we will keep where the fiends sleep neath the shroud of the foggy dew. Hey there, folks. I continue to be the mysterious JG, and this continues to be Red Dead Redemption. But for the first time, this <laughs> Red Dead Redemption 2, but for the first time, we find ourselves in first person mode. <laughs> Not sure if this is going to stick. Not sure if this is supposed to be a thing. Um, I recently, for the new Final Fantasy game, and by new I mean Bobo and Bean got it for me as a Christmas gift, like. Uh, over a year ago, and I still haven't gotten around to playing it, even though I intend to, but I did download the first-person mode uh, DLC, which you actually pay for, um, despite having still not gotten around to playing the game. Yeah, well. I'm going to Let's Play it, too. That was the, that was the plan. Well, whatever. Let's talk to Dr. Strauss. Herr Strauss. How are you enjoying yourself here? Well enough, Thanks I for guess. getting me out of first person well, mode. It turns out the pursuit of freedom is not a cheap business. Not Go for figure. us and not for some of the locals. Sharking already. I prefer to call it banking. You ain't the one handing out the beatings. No, but I am the one feeding the women and children in the camp. What choice should we have, Mr. Well, Martin? I'm feeding the women and children Come in the on. camp. I'm, what Show the fuck? Me. Here's the list. Refinery worker turned hunter. Besides banking is when you bounce the Vinton cue ball Holmes. off of the, uh, rail. Up in the rail and... of Strawberry. Ah, an apprentice undertaker. This one working in rows. His name was Gwen Hughes. It was. How many of them do you think will be able to pay? <laughs> With enough encouragement, both of them. <laughs> Mr. Spencer? Nope. I'm in first person mode all of a sudden. Individuals that owe you gang, owe you gang money, or maybe this changes when I get on the horse. Because this is actually surprisingly disorienting. You're my lovely horse, aren't you? Yeah. Let's go, boy. Okay, never mind. I'm an idiot. You, this is that is a thing that you were supposed to be able to do. No, oh, well. Hopefully, not too too many people wrote in the comments about how I'm an idiot in the last video. But then again, that would be people writing in the comments. That's something. So, machina are forbidden in roads, but we're supposed to go use. Uh, we're supposed to go extort money. Also, we got to go all the way to Strawberry. That's a pretty long ass way. I feel like that would actually be faster by boat. Unfortunately, this game has a thing where. Well, no, hold on. This game has a thing, and I say unfortunately, but no, it 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 makes perfect sense, but. You can't just freaking ride your uh, horse, like, you know, get all the way across the map and ignore your horse and then have your horse teleport to your location. As convenient as that would be, it's not realistic and the game doesn't let you do that. But we would need a stable in order to summon our horse and there does not, I don't think Strawberry has a stable. Well, yes, it does. But that stable is pretty far inland. We'd have to go, I don't know if we'll be allowed to go up that river. Yeah, you know what? I was thinking this would be a good good chance to map out some of this lake here. And it would be a little bit more direct, but I think the trouble in recovering our horse would actually end up taking longer than just uh, riding. Riders on the storm. Oh, you know what? I should check my progress on the... Uh, progress, not player. Progress. The next horse mission, the one of the I'm not doing all the challenges, but the horse ones seem to be kind of coming together on their own. And uh, 
I need to kill seven enemies from horseback without dismounting. I probably, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm a dumbass. I need to, yeah. So I killed a few enemies on horseback, but the next time I do that, I probably need to make a point of, like, finding enemies to kill on horseback without dismounting. This is going to turn, though, th this one will be a little bit more challenging. This will turn into uh, kill a certain enemy, kill enemies in a certain amount of time with throwing knives. It won't be probably as difficult, but I'll have to go out of my way to find opportunities to do it. Like when I had those respawning uh, guys on that farm, I could have killed them from more spec. What really, the real question then becomes, do I... I don't know who that was. Calm down, we. You're just a waste of time. Like, question is, do those guys count as enemies? Somebody was... What the hell? Somebody's, like, talking. We can hear somebody talking. It sounds like, it sounds like a stranger mission or something. Partner, nice to see you. Hey there, good to see you. Yeah, it is a stranger, sort of. How you doing today? Well, you see this here? American ginseng. Take a feller from not too bad to hardy as buck in no time. Really something. Yep, you don't find this every day. Dose this in your medicine, give it some zip. Believe me. Whatever you're selling, I ain't buying. Anyway, I ain't gonna use all of this, so feel free to help yourself to whatever's left. You take care now. I can't pick it. I can't care anymore. Alright, just some random dude who vaguely talks about herbology with you. this too while they all not. Yeah, but they, as far as the ease of doing the kill seven enemies from horseback, the question is, do they have to be hostile to you before you kill them? Can I just, like, ride up to random people and shoot them and then shoot the witnesses and just get a kill stream going if I really want to do that challenge? Or does it have to be guys who can fight back who are, like, registered as, you know, enemies? And by registered as enemies, I mean the game is registered as enemies. Not that there's some office, government office somewhere where people, like, you know, register as official enemies of Arthur Morgan. <laughs> but you, you probably knew that without me explaining it. You're just asking to get killed. Uh, fortunately for you, I really don't got time. I just don't got time to take the carcass anywhere. It's just like it, it was finding every way not to evade my path, and it clearly it was like it was a, um, a prey animal that was spooked and was trying to escape, and it just kept finding ways to continue to go the way that I was trying to go. game does somebody was saying in the comments this game needs the like uh, long uh, long ride uh, easy listening theme I don't think they meant easy listening in the sense of like easy listening music there was a the onion is one of those websites that I'll just like quick check on the onion when I'm at work and just need to get away from it for a second uh, they had a recurring it all. 
the hell happened with my horse there? It got really upset for a second. But uh, they had a thing where they said, Our Red Dead Redemption 2's immersive experience ruined by smooth jazz soundtrack. And they had just put together gameplay video of people riding around playing, you know, in Red Dead Redemption and they, they were playing like smooth jazz and it was kind of amazing. That's a realistic bit of scenery there. Got a little silt deposit going. Reminds me a little bit of the Platte River. If I come and say hi to you guys, you're going to get hostile. Or can I just ride by and say hello? You're probably going to get all hostile. We'll scuttle the story Excuse and run her aground. You ain't supposed to be here. I said go. 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 Don't mind me. Yeah, I figured they'd be assholes. Yep. Guess I could have robbed them. That would start the bandit. Yeah, you know, I got to rob somebody uh, and start those bandit challenges going because they might be really fun. I just haven't even triggered the very first one yet. Just trying to get my little cheap, easy paragon points so that I can have a high paragon meter because for some reason I feel like that's going to be a thing that matters. Yeah. Five will give you ten. Our protagonist dies horribly at the end, and then rumors persist for years that if you have a per if you have the highest paragon meter possible, and uh, you've captured all the legendary fish. And uh, your timer ends in a zero, and you defeat Shang Long with no continues, then uh, Arthur can live. Rumors, rumors like that will persist for years. I don't know for a fact that a protagonist dies. I got a feeling. I mean, you, you could always have some kind of ending where Arthur saves John Marston's life, and John Marston agrees to pretend that. Up to and including in his own internal thoughts to pretend that Arthur's dead to make sure that his identity is protected. I'm trying to greet them. Wasting away again at Margaritaville. Looking for my lost picture. So some people say that there's a woman to blame, but I know it's my own damn Easy, easy. Did I miss whoever this weirdo is? Uh-oh. Yeah, goddamn Chinaman, all right. Let's try not to get killed here, but... Boiled Satan? Yeah, I get that a lot. So, what's that you got there? Critter's a little prospector it's syndrome? No scrap paper. It's nothing. Just something for wiping and sniffing in the night. Yeah. Well, I got to go now. Hey, why the hurry, partner? Well, I got a hot tail. Don't you follow me now. This is as nice as I'm gonna ask. Hand it over. Now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No need for that, friend. Wait, did he escape? What the hell? I shot him three times. I shot him three times. What the hell, game? I mean, I know the weapon ain't in great condition, but damn. 
I don't know how the hell I'm going to find him now. What would I load to if I loaded my game? That that sucked. Got guys being mean to me by the riverbank, and then I run into somebody, and I try to talk friendly to them and trigger story, and it don't work. Uh, looks like just coming into this menu triggered an auto save. Well, all right, I guess I just fucked up the treasure maps forever. Unless I can, unless the game resets the fact that I talked to that guy and didn't get the map. Howdy. How do, sir? Well, I'm gonna have to look and see if I just. Check and see if I've permanently screwed something up here, but uh, I might have permanently screwed up there by uh, letting that guy escape with the map. But I can probably try to look that up between videos here. And I've got, I could just basically toss this whole goddamn video if I need to. Damn. Yourselves lumbermen, you afraid of us few damn critters? It's a forest. What the hell do you expect? Does this mean I got a mission where I can Oh Yeah. Yes, yes. Maybe you're the man I need. Can you believe these lazy lily livers? Refusing to work on account of a few little wolves. Will the wolf They've survive? Been packing workers on the south side of the camp. We need a real man to get rid of them. A man's man, like Stephen Regal. Well or, I mean, William Regal. All right. If you're paying, I should be able to take care of that for you. If you're paying. An undisclosed sum. Because that's how this game tends to work. I guess this will make up for permanently losing a treasure map. Apparently this is in bad condition. One of them was. I was getting a message saying one of the weapons was in bad condition. So that might have been. Uh, this is Midnight's pistol. It might have been. Oh yeah, the double pistol. What? Why am I even using this? Blacko's revolver, Granger's revolver. Okay, it was a mistake to even have it equipped. Something. At some point, I accidentally unequipped Flacco's revolver. So that's. And honestly, as much as I like uh, Midnight's pistol, it's using a different fancy pants ammo because um, Granger's revolver and Flacco's revolver both um, fancier. I wonder if I get to kill uh, wolves from horseback and have that count. Of course, that'll mean I can't dismount and do anything with their uh, pelts, but. I gotta follow a trail. Well, 
least I don't gotta specifically interact with that stuff. Are we sure this is a uh, wolf trail? Because I would think that if, unless it's a wolf species I've never encountered before, I would believe it wouldn't say unknown animal, it would say wolf. I guess there's different species of wolf. Oh, this is not good timing for any of this. First of all, I just got killed and I'm not running out of juice in my controller anyway. So, this is just really, really kind of sucking. Uh, I'm not sure that I didn't lose a treasure chest permanently. I, uh, went in to kill some wolves and was trying to do it from horseback and, of course, got pulled off my horse because why wouldn't I be pulled off my horse? Not really sure if I got penalized monetarily for that. Let's try this again. My health ain't great, which is understandable. I was just recently killed. Was just, yeah, so now I'm, I'm, I'm in the same trap that I was with the damn knife challenge. Now I'm going to make a challenge more difficult by refusing to get off my horse and start shooting at the wolves with a rifle from a distance. I'm going to instead be trying to kill them up close. Because that way I can kill them rapidly and potentially without getting off the horse. Now, this does, again, this may not even be counting. I probably should. But unless I got seven whole wolves attacking me, it's not going to matter anyway, because I'm going to end up getting off the horse. And it doesn't look like it counted. Certainly some of these wolves are dead. Yeah, it didn't count. That didn't count. All right. Well, that was a failed experiment then. All right, I killed him. Shit, it's a problem. Scared of dead wolves? What a pussy. That's a poor wolf pelt. 
kind of makes sense on account of I shot them completely full of lead. So how good do I expect the pelts to be? Kalos would be horrified if he hadn't given up on my channel because I acknowledge the existence of sexism. Well, we're getting big game meat out of this, which I believe we can know, sell. Boy. Nearly done. So I'll now have to go look. Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Come on, boy. I just dropped the wolf pelt on the ground. But yeah, I will now need to go look up whether or not, um, I don't know what Google search terms I'll put in, um, random encounter, treasure, hunter, escape, but just find out if we completely and permanently screwed up a treasure map <laughs> by having some guy who clearly had a treasure map and he was worried about Chinamen and then, um, he, he got out. Because I shot him three times in the back, and uh, he still managed to teleport away. Oh, never mind. That's That marker was where the wolves were supposed to be, not... Uh... So we'll go talk to George Foreman up here, and his son's George, 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 and George. And there might have been another George. This, uh... And then we'll talk to George's friend Larry, and his cousin Daryl, and his other cousin Daryl. And then we'll um, call it a video. I'm thinking even if we don't get the treasure map, it, the game may not work like this. There may be it may not let you cheat hacks and just look up the treasure map online and go to where the treasure is. The treasure might not spawn if you don't have the map. But um, it's another thing I hopefully can find out via Google Magic. Hey friend. Oh, there you are. I assumed from all the Gunshots and howling. You got some good news for me? Yep, it's done. <laughs> I got her done. Deep, deep, deep. Excellent work. Money's right there on the table. Don't mention it. Me and wolves go way back. I'm a big fan of the wolf slam. Fifty bucks. Not too bad. Not too bad. I'm leaving. Don't work too hard. There ain't much danger of that with this bunch, my friend. And you know what? For a few extra Paragon points. Hey, boy. <coughs> All right, you lazy bastards. You get back to work first thing in the morning. The wolves are gone, so no more excuses. Hey, I wonder if it's always nighttime when you talk to this guy. I think that's a good time to call a video. When we come back, I will have looked up whether or not we're currently screwed out of a treasure chest. If so, I'm probably in a freaking mood in the game. Damn it. I'm Mysterious JG. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys next time, one way or the other. Bye bye.